Well, good morning, folks. How are you? Um, I'm uh, sitting in the office today on a very, very wet day. We've got a thunderstorm hanging overhead for a while. Just wanted to catch up, talk about a few things. Um, I'll do probably one more post before I head to hospital. I'm going for an operation on the 27th of March to have my total right shoulder replaced. So I'm not looking forward to it, to be perfectly honest with you, but I really have to do something about it. And in saying that, uh, the show, because because we're expanding a great deal these days, the show is actually going to be uh, hosted by Sophia Stacey, my head of production, who is a wonderful ray of sunshine, and Jenny, who also does our admin and IT management, is going to be heading with her to Victoria um, next week. So um, they're going to be down there. Safe's a fantastic woman. She's really smart. She's got a fantastic personality, uh, very, very knowledgeable about art and film. I mean, after doing this with me for the last five years, she doesn't really have much of a choice. But uh, she's going to be doing that uh, down there as well, which is fantastic. Uh, also, we go to air in England uh, to quite a few million viewers on the 3rd of April. So any of the artists that uh, we have filmed, I'll be getting the details from the station in regards to when your shows will go to air. They're going to be airing five shows a week. We sent them 150 odd shows. Um, and then what they want to do is, is work with Ian Walton over there. Now go and have a look at Ian's work. He's fantastic as well. He's going to, uh, and has been helping us build that uh, in the United States and talking to some major sponsors over there. So I'd say that England will, will go very, very, very well. Um, and then we'll get over there hopefully in the summertime or their summertime and then begin filming and showing the guys what to do and then away they go. Uh, Richard Sturgles, my dear friend Richard, who we filmed uh, 14 months ago, uh, just flew back to the United States uh, last week after coming down here and doing two workshops, all of them completely booked out and with the responses that we had and the testimonials, everybody had a really great time and really learnt some stuff that they may not normally have been able to uh, get a hold of somebody down here. So congratulations to everybody that was there as well. And also, uh, Rich is actually hosting the show in America now. So uh, while I'm sort of being beaten up by a surgeon, um, these guys are stepping up to the plate and uh, taking over. And, and, and I have to say that uh, and initially, of course, I came up with the idea and it has very been much me pulling it and pushing it forward to get it where it needs to go. But Colour In Your Life is not about me by any means. It never has been. It's about the artists and it's about a format for the artists to tell people across the world who they are and also to demonstrate their particular abilities and their, their life story really. So the idea of Colour In Your Life has definitely left the ground these days and uh, I'm so happy that I was able to to get it to where it is. I'm not going to be stepping back completely. It's going to take me about three months to uh, to get my shoulder organised, but I will be back on a plane and then hopefully four countries by the end of the year uh, doing what we do. And then, uh, as I said, Rich will be taking over um, the process in California. And then when I'm better, we'll start to cross, you know, we'll be looking at Canada, uh, India's still there and some of the other European countries as well. So. Lots happening, lots expanding, lots of great companies coming on board. Very happy and so pleased for everybody that's been involved. And thank you for everybody that supported us along the way. Now, in saying that, we have a Patreon page. Now, I'm going to put the sign up again. If you can't afford to help, it might only cost you $2 a month. It's, a, it's not even a cup of coffee. But if you guys can afford to help and come in, it's going to enable us to be able to pull this together on a global basis. And that's so important. Everybody from across the world... Can you come to Norway? Can you come to Sweden? Can you come to Denmark, South Africa, India? I mean, can you come and do this? And I think that we can, but we obviously need the support. I mean, we've, we've done it really on the bare bones of our bums to try and pull all this together. And nobody's driving Ferraris, I can assure you. Um, we've, we've worked really hard seven days a week for the last six years to try and do this. And if you guys can help, please. So I'm going to hold up the sign. There it is right there. Right, Patreon. Now I'm going to leave it there for a little while. You can always stop the video, of course. And then, um, yeah, if you can go in there, tell your friends. Uh, it's obviously a worthwhile cause. If you're watching this now, you realise that that's the case anyway. 
and then uh, and then help us do this. I mean, this money is not going into my coffers; it's going into you know what we said we'd do, and that's get the teams and myself to these varying countries, and uh, and film people all over the world. So if you can come in and help us on that situation, please do so. It's very important. Uh, I mean, we don't ask a lot, and we give 110 percent all the time with what we do, and your help would greatly be appreciated. Uh, but I'll get back to you again. Uh, as I said, some fantastic things happening. Um, this is coming out. Um, I'm going to look like Stephen Austin after a while. I've titanium joints everywhere, but that's my age and that's life, and that was my lifestyle, I must admit. So, uh, But uh, thank you, everybody. You're fantastic, and keep supporting us and keep telling other people what we're doing and go into Patreon and help us out if you can. Thank you. Bye.